the angels will make trumpet call. And the Son of Man will appear on the clouds of the sky with power and glory. He will send his angels to all directions and all the tombs will be opened. of the dead will be covered with flesh and they will regain life. Every hidden things, good or bad, will be revealed before the throne of God. Books will be opened. Everyone, both meek and strong, will stand before the throne of Jesus. Every person will be judged according to his deed. Man who set his wife on fire and possessed another woman. denied the poor and squandered his wealth.
Attitude. A greedy doctor who exploited patients. One who had persuaded people to worship man-made idols. All those whose name is not found written in the book of life will be thrown into the lake of fire. depressed and proclaimed Jesus to many. A righteous woman who helped the gospel ministry from her poverty. abandoned and left according to the word of God. A woman who heard the word of God and accepted Christ with repentance sacrificed his own life for the word of God. Those who lived on earth according to the word of God, their bodies will be transformed, glorified and will be taken to eternal home. Whose names are written in the book of life, they will enter paradise. Former things are passed away.
no sadness, no moaning, no enmity. No disputes or hatred. There will be joy and peace. The holy city, the new Jerusalem, came down out of heaven from God. The city of pure gold, walls made of jasper, pearls on all the gates. The names of the twelve tribes of Israel and the names of the twelve apostles were written on it. whose names are written in the Lamb's Book of Life, only those will enter there. The city does not have sun or moon to shine on it, but the glory of God gives it light. There will be no night. The water of life flowing from the throne of God. Those who have been chosen by God will have reward there. There will be no more death. The tree of life is there. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. You must remember, Jesus will come again to raise you from death and give you eternal life.